because Lottie's whole philosophy is that you have to face the past in order to come into your truth today. You know, and I think it taps into a lot of philosophies of present day therapy as well. And so I think she's absolutely saying at this point, you need to address who that was in order to be free of that person, that other you. And and maybe you need to embrace parts of that because that other you was strong. She was courageous. She was generous and she was present. So perhaps it's a little criticism of present day time that she's so caught up in her own shit <laughs> that maybe she could draw something, some inspiration, some some something from her former self and that her former self wasn't all that bad. So maybe if she acknowledges her former past, then to the present, she won't have these terrible visions because she's pushing them down a lot like Lottie. And that's Lottie's, it's very gracious of Lottie to give Ty that advice when her inner turmoil is like, oh my God, what is happening for me? But she sees that in herself. And they're the only two characters that really have these strong mm -hmm. visions. And, you know, Lottie's is self-sacrifice and and Ty's is, you know, dirt eating and 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 completely not being, you know, a duality. So I think. Lottie and giving the advice to Ty is actually taking that on herself as well. 